Okay, uh, this is just a quick video of a snake. I'm not sure exactly what kind it is, but I was getting out of my vehicle in preparation to do a shooting video. And I've already worked pretty good this morning cutting down, oops, cutting down some uh, trees and such. And as I was getting out, I noticed this guy just kind of laying up here in the cut. See if we can get a zoom on that one. Yeah, there you go. And now this guy is kind of long. I'm not a snake expert at all. I guess years ago I probably could have told you a little better, but I haven't really thought about snakes in a long time. You know, I think all kids go through a fascination with snakes and so did I. So I'll just have to look this guy up and see exactly what kind he is. Let's see if we can approach with caution. All right, where's, okay, there he is. I'm thinking it might be a corn snake of some sort. But in any case, this is just one of those things where you have to be aware of your surroundings. And obviously I could use a little refresher on my snake identification. I don't see any rattles on the back. It doesn't look like it's a uh, cotton mouth or anything like that. So... I'm almost certain that it's not a poisonous guy. But of course, as I said, let me see here. They say you can always tell by the eyes because the vipers have those uh, slotted eyes and non-poisonous snakes. I think with the exception of the coral snake, you don't see those guys too many, too often, uh, have those slotted eyes and I think pits for pit vipers. So they have those heat sensing organs on their face. So this guy looks like he has round eyes. So I'm going to assume that he's not poisonous. But once again, I'm just going to leave him alone and go on about my business, make my video, and get back to the house for some lunch. All right, thanks for watching. And let me know what you guys think about snakes and whatnot. All right, bye-bye.